Good morning. My name is Tom Adams, and I am speaking on behalf of Larry Phillips, who is a dear brother and friend of mine. He is a bit under the weather, and if you are given to remember him in prayers, he would greatly appreciate it. Today, let's look at the book of Acts, chapter 17, verses 10 through 12. And the brethren immediately sent away Paul and Silas by night unto Berea, who coming thither went into the synagogue of the Jews. These were more noble than those in Thessalonica, in that they received the word with all readiness of mind, and searched the scriptures daily whether these things were so. Therefore many of them believed, also of honorable women which were Greeks, and of men not a few. Therefore many of them believed. That is clarified earlier on in the book of Acts, chapter 13, verse 48. And when the Gentiles heard this, they were glad and glorified the word of the Lord, and as many as were ordained to eternal life believed. The many here are those that were, etern that were ordained to eternal life. It's not because they searched the scriptures daily. It's not because they heard the word preached. It's only because they believed only because they were ordained to believe. But I am bringing this, these verses up because it is clear that Berea, the men in Berea, or the Bereans, were of more noble character than those in Thessalonica. Why? Because, number one, they received the word, the truth, with all readiness of mind. And number two, they didn't just accept it because of who was saying it. They searched the scriptures daily to test it. Scripture says to try all things and to hold on to that which is good. These men did that, and that, why, that is why they were considered more noble. If you are in a fellowship, or if you are in a group, and cannot ask questions, you cannot um, go to someone if they say something wrong, or you, if you feel they say something wrong, I would leave, because that is not nobleness. I can only assume here, but if the Bereans heard something that Paul or Silas said, and if they went to them, that they would have readily brought them in and received their questions and would have been able to expound upon them and either set them right or explained what they meant. Again, be as a Berean, search the scriptures daily, search whatever you hear by whomever you hear it and I ask that you search the scriptures daily for anything that I may say and test it according to scripture. Don't test it to what you've heard. Don't test it to the traditions that you've been brought up with. Test it with scripture. And I hope that these words might be an encouragement to you and may you have a good day.